Feet onto your toes. You can have your hands up to the side. If you can't touch your toes just yet, don't worry about it. You want to aim for about 10 reps each side, stretching for your hamstrings, keeping your core nice and tight. If you think of driving through your heels to get up, your glutes should start to engage. Make yourself nice and tall and squeeze. What you do not want to do is you don't want to start squeezing forward. You just make yourself tall, tap, tall. Find that stretch on your hamstrings. That's the back of your neck as you're coming down. Once you did those, just swing yourself a bit left to right. Relax your shoulders down. Give yourself a good little twist. Think of looking behind you. Again, keep your core tight, keep your feet grounded. Same thing here, eight to 10 reps each way. Sometimes that gives a little click. If it clicks, that's fine as long as there's no pain. Then we reach up, hinge, reach up. As you're hinging, you feel more squeeze here, a stretch here. As you're coming up, your glutes squeeze and your shoulders come right above your head. You don't want to just stop here. Just about eight, 10 reps. Really let your arms swing. Squeeze your glutes and your core. If that all feels good, side lunges, nice and wide stand. Keep the foot on the floor to start with and sit back. If you find after a few reps, it starts to be a little more easy, open your legs a bit and stretch. If your feet or your toes want to come off the floor, that's fine. Just focus on that stretch here. And you again want to think of sitting back rather than trying to stay over your foot. So your bum comes back and your bum comes back. Again, eight to 10 reps is enough. And then still doing the side lunge, but twisting around keeping your core nice and tight. As you're coming up, try for your heel, for the end. And then check in with your squats. Sometimes your feet slide into the trainers a bit weirdly. Just make sure your feet are good. Plant your feet, drive your knees out, nice and controlled back. If you need for balance your hands out, feel free to have your hands out for balance. If you're squatting, make sure your feet are grounded, your bum comes back, drive your heels in to get up, just make yourself tall. Do not push over here. Eight to 10 reps is just fine. Sit back, find a good stretch, push your knees out, keep your knees out. When you did your reps, we do some walkouts, walk yourself out in a plank and then stretch your leg forward. You wanna make sure your heel stays on the floor. And we just swap legs. And then we walk all the way back up, just to go back down again. Walk yourself down, swing your leg forward, give yourself a good stretch. Swap legs. Walk yourself back up and back down. When you're down here this time, swing your leg forward and give yourself a good stretch. Same thing the other way. Walk yourself back up. And one more time, walk it all out. Stretch your hip, rotate, swap legs, rotate, and walk yourself back up. And that's your warm-up.